Hello, thank you for purchasing your AT&T wireless broadband brought to you by AT&T and Data Remote. Your CDS9010 supports your critical wire devices with two LAN ports as well as any wireless devices with built-in Wi-Fi access point. Plus, with a battery backup, you will also receive up to 12 hours of battery backup. Today, I'll be showing you how to set up your CDS9010. So over here, we have the CDS9010 box. After opening it, inside, you will find your setup instructions, the CDS9010, two LTE antennas, yellow ethernet cable, power plug, the battery pack, and the filler cartridge. Keep in mind that your SIM card will come separately. Now the SIM card may be blue or orange. We're going to start off by connecting the antennas. Take the two LTE paddle antennas and connect them to the gold LTE antenna ports on the back of the device. Make sure the antennas are not touching. The ideal placement of the unit is by a window. Now locate the SIM slot 1 on the right hand side of the open slot of the device. Pop out the full size SIM card. Be careful not to break the smaller size out. Insert the SIM card into the SIM slot 1. Gold chip face down until you hear a click. Hold it onto the sides so as you don't break the smaller SIM card out. Do not use SIM slot 2. If there seems to be a connectivity issue, please call the Mobility Call Center number in the guide to confirm the SIM's activation. Now, insert the battery pack into the left side open slot of the device. Take the battery with a label facing up. Push until you hear a click. Insert the filler cartridge into the right hand side of the device. Push until you hear a click. Now plug the power cable to the AT&T 9010. Then plug the attached power supply into a wall outlet. Now we're going to connect your critical wire device or devices. Connect any available yellow ethernet cord on the CDS 9010. to the WAN of your device. Now, connecting your wireless devices. You can connect your wireless devices by using the SSID and password that are available in the Quick Start Guide. Then, test your connectivity by browsing the internet. Congratulations! The installation of your AT&T wireless broadband is now complete. If you have any problems with the device, please contact support, which is available on the first page of your instructions guide. Thank you again for purchasing your AT&T wireless broadband, brought to you by AT&T.